And we've moved up uh, from Caliani, a couple of miles. And I am standing on the top of uh, tunnel number two. This is the second place where the railroad changes directions 180 degrees. Right now that train is going railroad south, but he's going compass west. BNSF. Uh, Tunnel 2 right underneath us. And we will walk right over here. Hope I don't see any rattlesnakes or anything. There he is emerging from Tunnel 2. We will be going compass east. Taking the signal right there, that is the uh, north end of the siding of Bealville. Again, they're out there in the background. This location isn't that difficult to get to. That is uh, Calany Bobfish Road right there see it along the tracks in the shop before, but uh, pretty neat place to get pictures and shoot videos. You can uh, park right down there by the, by the north portal of uh, Tunnel 2 if you like, get pictures down there. Snaking up the hill through Bealville here. This was once actually a siding called Allard, and it uh, wasn't a very long siding, about a mile long. They tied Allard and Bealville together. Bealville is up uh, further up towards Bealville, the Bealville Crossing. There was actually a, a station up there, a telegraph and train order station right next to the Bealville Crossing. They tied those uh, two sidings together. I believe they did that in the 40s. Have to look and see for sure. I could be wrong about that. If anybody knows for sure, you can put it in the comments. I don't mind being told that I'm mistaken about something. Backs and coal cars on this. It's listed as a Z train, uh, 5,500 tons. One of the cool things about the uh, CAD screens we have that give us uh, information on trains, they give them their, uh, their designations, how many uh, empties, how many loads they're hauling, the tonnage and the footage of each train. Let's see, this is a We'll come to the other side, and there's Calany Bodfish Road. This is the section between Bina Road, the old Highway 466, which is what Edison Highway turns into. And this turns off just before it crosses under the freeway, under the freeway at 58. This road goes down into Calany, where we were earlier, and heads up over the hill into uh, Bodfish, Havila, or you can split off up. Chalini Creek Canyon to Paris Lorraine and Twin Oaks. The end of the train, 5,500 tons. Sounds like a lot, and it is a lot. That's that's a lot of weight, but. Where trains are concerned, that's not all that heavy. Not heavy enough to warrant using drone pusher units. What 
not sure what the temperature is. I wasn't paying much attention to the truck there a minute ago, but it seems like it's cooled off considerably in the last half an hour. It was about 85 degrees when we were down at Caliente and the breeze has kicked up. A little bit of cloud cover feels pretty good. second compass direction change of the tracks between Bakersfield to Hatchby. This, once again, is Tunnel 2 and the north end of 